How do my artists welcome to the Tapu Bulu Ultra stage going in with Mega Tyranitar, Incinerator, Talonflame and Ho-Oh. As you can see here almost a full item run, the plus 5 moves entirely unnecessary, I wasn't sure how this stage was going to be with all these items. I tried it a couple of different ways that I'll explain to you. Uh, what I tried, what worked, what didn't work. And the main thing I would say is this was the best mega I could find. Using the Tyranitar was the most um, comprehensive one. It was the one that worked the most often. I did also try Alakazam. Alakazam would work without the disruption delay as that takes away uh, 10 blocks breakable or unbreakable every time you make a match. So that would be very helpful if you're not using the disruption delay. Beyond that I did also try a Rayquaza just with a disruption delay hoping that the combo would be able to take me but if you don't use the complexity minus one there's also a Whiskot on the stage which just made it really hard to get any form of a combo. Beyond that, those were the two two main ones that I tried that weren't the Mega Tyranitar, which definitely worked best for me. Talonflame getting rid of the blocks, Incinero there for the super tackle that can do 4,000 worth of damage. 44% here. Wasn't able to catch it, but one Mega Ball with a super catch power wasn't much of an issue. If you're gonna go without the complexity minus one, take along something like Excelgor that's got eject plus plus to get rid of those whimsa cots. They would go caught without much issue at all. Very difficult one if you're not using complexity minus one. But attack power 70 and block smash plus plus. This is a Pokemon that will be used and awful lot. It's one you're going to want to beef up incredibly quickly as grass types very common type to use and block smash plus plus is a very very well sought after skill for your Pokemon to have. But there we go. Thank you very much for watching and how do my artists? Eggs! Eggs! E-double-G-S eggs! <laughs> <laughs>